want to show you what I'm going to do with my coleus. All summer they've been growing in containers on my porch and now I want to overwinter them. Let me show you my simple plan. I broke some branches but I'm totally good with that though because I was gonna whack this one down just like I'm gonna cut down the other one so I'm just gonna trim it now instead of in a day or two alrighty Where are we? And this will be really helpful anyway, because we all know, or if you're new to a coleus, these are the kind of plants that when you chop them down, they grow back bushier and healthier. So a good haircut for these guys makes them really happy. I had the clippers out. I was like, why wait? Let's just do this now. <laughs> this may look like a really hard cut to people that are new to gardening but I'm not afraid of giving plants a hard cut I think it really just helps in the big picture I, and you know and I'm not a novice I've been studying a lot on um, the coleus here and how this is a very healthy thing for them so I mean he's happy look he's happy <laughs> Gonna set them up in the, the other room now. So I ended up planting, or I should say replanting, one of the other coleuses too. Uh, I think it was this this one here because the pot that it was in was a little bit smaller, and I want them all in equal sized pots because um, it will be easier next year when I'm rearranging everything out there. But I gave everything a good healthy water and a good you know, and I let them drain for a while in the sink, and now I'm going to put them in the room for the winter. I decided not to trim this guy because he has not gotten gotten leggy and he's still bushy and green so I'm just gonna let him go big for a little bit longer till I trim this one back I just didn't have the heart to do it the other ones they were already leggy and are getting that way so I was fine trimming them okay so there we go this is where these guys are gonna hang out this winter this window gets the most sun and it should be really good for them. I will give you periodic uh, updates to see how they're doing. My next garden video will probably be next month when I clean out the garden. I'll show you how they're doing a month from now. Thank you for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Have a good one. Toodles.